Welcome to Penby Photography. I'm Penny and I'm speaking to you from the new forest and the car park I stopped at. So this is Ashley Walk. Um, so I am very local to myself, uh, uh, to where I live. And um, this tree, it, there's a tree. Oh, you can't see it. My big fat head's in the way. Oh, look, there's a little dot. Just there. Um, it's not a particularly fantastic tree, but all my life <laughs> I've walked past this tree and uh, I've seen it in some lovely conditions and I, I want to take a photo of it. Today I don't have the conditions, but not all is lost. So I thought I would go out and have a look, um, see if I can find a nice position that when I do get position the conditions I would like, which is probably a bit of mist and some light hitting the mist and stuff like that. Um, I could go straight to that spot and and do the photo I would like. But it's it's not been terrible. It was terrible when I was in the car at the top there. But as I've been walking, the sun has been breaking through. It is sort of spitting the rain. Um, but I think I've got a photo and taking that photo, I think I've got another photo as well. We'll see, you'll see in a minute, I'm gonna show you what I've taken. So the picture I've come to do, or stopped here for, was to get this tree. And because it's gray and horrible, um, 
in my mind I thought I was going to do a black and white very simple just the tree on top of a hill maybe a square um, but this this is not this shot at the moment I don't know if I'm going to take that or not yet uh, but uh, as I was walking we've got a load of new forest ponies in the foreground here and I just thought do you know that's going to make a nice a nice foreground so um, so what I've done is I've come down low to shoot through the ponies I've got my 100 to 400 lens on and it's at the 100 end of so the shortest end of the of the focal range I've gone for f16 because I just want everything in focus and with this long lens um, it's not a massive depth of field it's not a massive depth of field but uh, the ponies are close and I've got uh, quite a long focal range on there so we've got ponies in the foreground and then going up and it looks quite small so it's not really the main subject but it's in the picture is the is the tree I wanted to get a photograph of um, while I was setting up to do this picture there is a little white Shetland just right close in the foreground here can you see oh yeah look she's right there um, uh, and she's a bit of a show off she wanted to come on over and she has a little friend I don't think he's in the frame or she's in the frame but she's just over there and I just took a couple of snapshots of them because it was an opportunity I couldn't miss I've just noticed how windy it is I hope you can hear me um, but and also as I was walking along the sun was coming out so look we all we better just take that and we had a, a moment of good sunlight. It's kind of turning a bit flat now, but as it was changing from the grey weather to, to the sun coming out, we actually had quite a nice, nice moment. So hopefully quite a nice shot. Um, I'm going on quite a lot. I'll show you the picture, this picture now, and if the other ones came out any good, uh, just the little snapshots, um, I'll, I'll show you them as well. Oh, it's getting windier and windier. I hope you can hear me. I do apologise if the wind's bad. Um, yes, well, we'll carry on and see if we can get that black and white, very basic shot. And um, yeah, and I'll check out the uh, the area for when I, I want to take a photo when it's misty and lovely. Anyway, onwards.
so it's quite windy sorry my face is dark and it's all rubbish I'm having to be quite close to the camera because I'm putting the microphone right to my face because it's quite windy I've managed to get my moody shot of the tree uh, I have exposed to the sky and put the tree completely in silhouette um, I've got f8 and whatever the appropriate shutter speed is shutter speed is not too slow because um, because it's quite windy and the branches are moving so I've uh, made sure my shutter speed is over a 60th I think so yes anyway all looks quite sharp I'll show you the picture to you now um, yes so I hope you like it um, the other thing is is this is not the shot this is I wouldn't come this close for the, a misty and lovely shot of this tree I think right at the beginning of my walk I was on a track right over there and um, if it was misty and there was good light that probably would be the best spot I have walked all the way around this tree and to it so um, yes yes so that's quite I'm quite pleased I've got two shots of this tree I've worked out a nice position for a picture in the future so yeah it's good um, so I put the picture on after I shut up but if uh, if you have enjoyed this video oh, that, and you've made it watching right to the end that's brilliant thank you so much um, if you did do that please like and then uh, if you haven't subscribed that would be amazing too um, also I love a comment let me know if you like the pictures or not um, yeah and I will see you next time take care bye bye <laughs>